The Legacy of Luna, The Story of a Tree, a Woman, and the Struggle to Save the Redwoods, by Julia Butterfly Hill is a powerful narrative that weaves together elements of environmental activism, personal transformation, and the enduring beauty of nature. Through her first-hand account of living in a towering redwood tree, Hill invites readers into a world where the boundaries between the self and the environment blur, ultimately compelling us to reconsider our relationship with the natural world. The book begins with Hill's decision to climb and live in Luna, a thousand-year-old redwood tree, in the headwaters forest of Northern California. This bold act of protest against the clear-cutting of ancient redwoods sets the stage for the larger narrative of environmental activism. From the outset, Hill's connection to Luna is visceral and profound. She describes the tree as alive, vibrant, and powerful, establishing it as a character in its own right. Luna, with its gnarled branches and towering presence, becomes not just a tree but a symbol of resilience and resistance. As Hill spends days, weeks, and ultimately two years in Luna, she undergoes a transformation that mirrors Luna's own growth. The tree becomes her refuge, teacher, and confidant. This transformation is central to the narrative as Hill grapples with her own insecurities, fears, and doubts. She learns to confront her inner demons and find strength in solitude and nature. Hill's description of the tree's ability to weather storms and adversity becomes a metaphor for her own resilience and determination. Through her experiences in Luna, she discovers a deeper sense of purpose and a connection to something greater than herself. The narrative also delves into the broader environmental context. Hill paints a vivid picture of the destruction wrought by the logging industry in the redwood forests. Her descriptions of clear-cut areas, stumps of ancient trees, and the devastation of ecosystems are both heartbreaking and infuriating. Through her storytelling, Hill effectively conveys the urgency of the environmental crisis and the need for grassroots activism. Luna, in this context, becomes a rallying point for the environmental movement, symbolizing the fight to protect the last vestiges of ancient redwoods. Hill's narrative is not just a call to action but a meditation on the power of nonviolent protest and civil disobedience. She describes the various tactics employed by the activists to draw attention to their cause, from tree sits to blockades. These actions are not only acts of resistance but also acts of love for the natural world. Hill's account challenges the reader to reconsider the value of nature and the ethics of its exploitation. One of the most compelling aspects of The Legacy of Luna is Hill's exploration of the human nature connection. She delves into indigenous wisdom and spirituality, drawing on her conversations with tribal elders and her own experiences in Luna. This spiritual dimension adds depth to the narrative, highlighting the profound interconnectedness of all living beings. Hill's journey is not just an environmental one but a spiritual one, as she comes to see herself as part of the web of life. The book also touches on the complexities of activism, including the toll it takes on personal relationships and mental well-being. Hill's isolation in the tree brings her moments of solitude and introspection but also loneliness and despair. She candidly shares her struggles, making her a relatable and empathetic protagonist. Her eventual decision to descend from Luna is a poignant moment in the narrative, reflecting the sacrifices activists make for their cause. In conclusion, The Legacy of Luna by Julia Butterfly Hill is a compelling and thought-provoking work that combines environmental activism, personal growth, and a deep reverence for nature. Hill's narrative skillfully intertwines her own journey with Luna's, highlighting the transformative power of the natural world and the importance of protecting it. This book is not just a memoir but a call to action, 
challenging readers to reconsider their relationship with the environment and the role they can play in preserving it. Through Hill's storytelling, Luna becomes more than a tree, it becomes a symbol of hope, resilience, and the enduring legacy of those who fight for the earth.